Here's how I spent day nine of my Kentucky trip. So we left Rome and then a while later we made it to Venice, which was one of the places that I was most excited about seeing on this trip, just because I think it's so unique. So once we got off the bus, we went onto a boat, obviously to make it over to Venice. And even just like coming up to it, I loved how colorful all of the buildings were. I just thought it looked like the cutest place. The color of the water was so nice. It just felt really magical and beautiful. Like I said, Venice is just so unique just because there's no roads or cars and it's just water everywhere and boats and I just thought it was the coolest place ever because it just felt so relaxed and like no one was in a rush and everyone was just sort of like taking their time and it was so nice just to wander all of the really like narrow streets and just see all of the boats around um, and it was just nice to not be around like a busy road and loads of cars and stuff like that so anyways we got onto one of these gondolas which i was so excited about because again this is something that's been on my bucket list for ages it was so cool i enjoyed it so much and i'm so glad i got to do that and then i had pasta because i've ate pasta every day that we've been in italy then we did some shopping it did start to rain actually but it wasn't till towards like the evening i got my souvenirs and just sort of wandered around a bit more uh just seeing as much as I could in the short space of time that we were there. Venice looked just as beautiful at night time, it was so nice seeing everything lit up and yeah here I was just waiting to get the boat back to our hostel. Um, so yeah it was a flying visit, I definitely need to go back to Venice and visit again sometime soon because I love it there and I'd love to have some more time to wander the cute little quaint streets.